noble time. Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I thought I'd bring you this tip video because I find it could be information that will help you guys enjoy the game a lot more. I understand a lot of people are not really having fun with World War II, but not gonna lie, I am. Why? Because I'm doing good in the game and I'm gonna show you guys how. First things first, what you need is a good class setup. If you don't have this class setup, I highly recommend you make it now. And if you missed my last video, which was my V2 rocket with the SDG 44, go ahead, check that video out first and then watch this video. Because in that video, I basically use the class extensively, dominate with it, and I get myself a V2. I really like this class a lot. Number one is because of the mountain division. You will stay as stealthy as possible from the other team's score streaks. And that includes UAVs. You're invisible to that. And I like the STG-44 because I believe it is the most balanced gun in the game. And it's a pretty good weapon overall. Make sure you make this class set up. Okay, now hold on. Before we watch the video, I forgot to mention another way of increasing that KD spread is making your score streaks a lot lower. Start off with the recon. That way, when you call it in, you can get your score streaks easier by knowing where the enemy team is at. You're going to get more kills, which will lead to your fighter pilot. And then you're going to be able to get your glide bomb. But guess what? When you use these streaks, you're going to be able to get kills a lot easier. And that's going to contribute to your overall KD spread at the end of the game. So, yeah, that's all I wanted to say. Don't set your score streaks high like I do. I've got, you know, the experience to get it. So that's why I put them high. For now, for beginners, I would say just keep it low. You can even recycle them over and over again. The more streaks that you go on and the more that you stay alive. And then before you know it, you'll have like the most kills on the team guaranteed but anyways guys back to the video sorry for the interruption now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go into a game i'm gonna find a match we're gonna play team deathmatch and i'm just gonna show you guys what i would do to stay alive and then i'll walk you through what i do what not to do and all that stuff so it looks like we're playing on uss texas oh by the way if you guys missed that um in my setup I had here the uh, S-Mine 44. I like to call it the Bouncing Betty because it's easier to say and it's what I'm used to uh, because it'll watch our backs wherever we are. So just pay attention and I'll see you guys in the game. <coughs> All right, we are back. In case you guys are wondering, that is a cough drop in my mouth. Shout out to Ricola. I'm battling with some Remember cough issues train. lately, Make so please strong. bear with me. Anyways. All right, USS Texas is a pretty popular map. I used to hate it at first, but then I started liking it. So when I spawn here, I'm going to crawl against this wall. Not literally like Spider-Man. Move, guy. And there's always going to be someone over here. I'm going to use this uh, head glitch. All right. I'm going to slowly move into the enemy's uh, base, which is right here. So I'm going to push this right there. It'll watch my back. Look at the look at the mini map. Teammate just died. Bam. Okay, now you're here you don't want to stick your head out. Woo, we got a kill, baby. Did you see that guy fly? Oh, someone's nearby. Someone's nearby. Let's go down here. Take a peek, pre-aim. Boom. Get out of there. Let's do it again. Someone's below us. Look at the mini-map. Hold on, call that UAV. Oh, boy. Ooh! Okay, I thought I had the infantry. Uh division on but i didn't anyways uh yeah you know you can't expect to go flawless a lot of bs is gonna happen but i guarantee you will get a higher kd after watching my video so what i just did there was i paid attention to where my uh teammate died and then i pre-aimed because i knew there was gonna be an enemy see what i'm saying by pre-aiming you have to do that in this game we all know the connection sucks looking at the minimap almost half the time Checking every corner when I enter a room and pre-aiming. That's the golden key. Now, pay attention to where my teammates are at right now on the map. See how they're all over there? What are they shooting at? Let's go check it out. Boom. Enemy there. That guy got away. Don't stick your head out too long. See, somebody's sniping now. Do the same thing. Put that right there. Wait. There you go. Keep your eyes peeled. Somebody right there. Somebody sniping back there. I'm not going to challenge that. It's too far. Somebody right there. Watch. Okay, let's not challenge that either. Don't want to get too cocky here. Okay, someone's coming up. Woohoo! Thank God, minimap. 
I, if that wasn't there, then I wouldn't have known he was there. So I can't really hang out for too long in these areas. Unfortunately, on this map, this is pretty much the only place you can hang out at. The map is not as dynamic. So you're kind of limited. I think somebody's below us. But we have a, a bouncing Betty there, so it's all good. Looking at my point of entry. Yes, I got somebody. Got me a kill. All right, now. Next part of the strategy is go downstairs. Okay, don't do that. Don't go outside, but chase the kill if you think it's safe. Pre-aim, pre-aim. Oh, yep. They're, they're on to me now. So I'm going to go over here. Take a peek. Nothing. Come back down. Pre-aim. Ooh, he got a little close. We're on a 10, though. Hold on. Look at your ammo. I don't have that much ammo. I got to grab a gun. I'm going to use my STG to the very end. Pre-aim, pre-aim. See how I just switched my location? Okay, hold up. Let's go down. Let's go. What? That's a teammate. That is a teammate. Coming down here to see if we got any uh, opportunity for some kills. Okay, look at that. Look at that recon. Recon the I'm going to pick my head out over here. Nothing. Somebody's in here. See how I pre-aimed to get that kill? Oh, somebody got us. Let's see where he was. Okay, he got us right behind us. It's all good. What are we? We're 60 to 2 right now, boys. I told you, you can't deny. You can't go perfect all the time. But if you really try and you pay attention to these tips, you can. I mean, I'm not doing anything amazing out of the ordinary. I'm just playing a strategy. That's how you do better in these games. Don't run around and look, you know, run around like idiots. You may see that I do that in my videos. But, you know, it's just for show. And I've been playing Call of Duty for so long. Pretty much everything's like second nature to me. But this is how I started. This is how I got better. Believe me. You got to slow the game down. Break it down piece by piece. And, uh... Play smart. It's a strategy. Same thing on this side. If the... Hold on. We got... We got nobody over here. Oh, that, that guy's over there sniping. I don't want to deal with that guy. So the strategy applies here as well. Okay. You know what? I'm going to push because I just want the game to end. Oh, right behind us. Got him. We're on that five. All right. Game is about to end, guys. Take these tips. Apply it to your game. Pre-aim. Pre-aim down every corner. Where's he at? I want that last kill. Almost got that. But anyways, 21 and 2. Um, that's a pretty good KD in my opinion. Like I said... Can't expect to go flawless, but if you play a lot smarter, you will do better in the game. Guaranteed. <laughs> oh, man, that was such a good timing. I, like, I just literally waited for that. All right, so, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you learned something from it. Be sure to subscribe, because I want to do a lot more to help out the community get better. And that's what I like doing on my channel. Again, I'm chewing on this hall, Ricola, I almost said halls. Shout out to Ricola for helping me out with my throat issues. <clears throat> it's flu season. Everybody get your rest, drink plenty of, plenty of water, and watch my videos. Don't forget to drop a like. Highly appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next one, yeah? All right, peace.